Okay, so we're going to solve the uh, first problem of the section three under the rational section, or yeah, and uh, the problem is a minus two over a plus three minus one equals three over a plus two. So the first thing we need to do is um, multiply by the denominator, the opposite denominator. So you multiply this by a plus two on both the top and bottom. <laughs> And then you do a plus three on this side. And then for this, this is, you're going to multiply this by a plus two and a plus three. And this will turn into a, um, and you also multiply on the bottom. <laughs> so what you're going to end up with, but, um, in the next step, is a plus two times a minus two over a plus two times a plus three. And then you'll do minus a plus two times a plus three over a plus two. Three. So what you're trying to do in these steps is find a common denominator between all of them. And the one, this is equivalent to one, but to find a common denominator, you need to multiply by those. And that equals, we're going to end up with three times a plus three over a plus two times a plus three. So you notice these all have a common denominator, so now you can just kind of stretch the bottom out. And then you end up with a plus two times a minus two minus a plus two, a plus three, and then that equals three, a plus three. So, and then you just wanna, um, Go ahead and foil it out, and then you end up with um, a squared plus 2a minus 2a minus 4 minus um, a squared plus 2a plus 3a plus 6, and that's equivalent to 3a plus 9. And then, so now what you're going to do is combine like terms. So you end up with then the entire equation uh, on this side as a squared minus four, because that does cancel each other out, minus a squared from over here. Minus five a minus six, and that is equivalent to three a plus nine. And then you just combine all of these, and so the a squared to cancel each other out. So now you just combine everything else, which will give you negative five a minus ten equals three a plus nine. And then so you want to do is just add 5a to both sides, just solve it with a normal equation now. Um, so then you end up with negative 10 equals 8a plus 9. And then you subtract 9 from over here. And then you get negative 19 equals 8a, divide the 8 off. And then you end up with a equals as a decimal. Um, you can either you can either put um, negative 19 over 8, or you can put the decimal equivalent, which is 2.375. Um.